It's been a little while since I've done an EDC video, probably about two years. 2018, springtime here. Let's see what I EDC. Let me turn the camera around and uh, empty out my pockets. Stay tuned. I think 2016 was the last EDC video and honestly not much has changed and that's why I haven't been too uh, pressed to get one of these done but a few things has cha have changed so let's jump right in the first thing I carry is my cell phone uh, this is just an LG G5 uh, I think this is probably the same phone I had in the last video actually so my cell phone. A lot of good useful apps that I can use on this. Obviously the phone, the GPS, the maps, as long as you have data. Um, so that's item number one. Let's, uh, there we go. Next up is my keys. Um, nothing special about my keys, just two car keys, house key, that kind of stuff. I don't keep any kind of fancy gadgets on there other than a MicroStream Nano, which um, is just a great little keychain light. I mean, it's only about 10 lumens, takes a few watch batteries, watch style batteries. But I use this thing a lot, and as you can see, I mean, the paint's wore off or the anodizing, wherever it is. I think it's probably my third one. Uh, it's just great to have around, you know, looking for, you know, you're walking out in the dark, you need to find the, 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 the key on your door, you know, the, the key slot on your door, anything like that. Just use a lot, and, you know, for under 10 bucks, it's, it's actually almost cheaper just to buy a new flashlight than it is to replace the batteries in these things, and like I said, that's what I've done. This is probably the third one I've had over the years. So that's just my keys. Uh, next up, Okay, just a basic mini Bic lighter. Uh, what else do I have over here? I do carry for a bigger light. I do carry the the micro stream from Streamlight. Um, I like this flashlight a lot, and I use this a ton as well. It's about uh, 45 lumens. Takes one AAA battery. A little over two hours on runtime on it. A uh, couple of reasons I like it. it. It's it's not too big and bulky, so it's uncomfortable in the pocket, but it's a good size to hold on to. You know, it's when you're holding something like this, it's just kind of hard to fumble around with this. But you know, that just feels like a more of a you know a full size flashlight. And the unique pocket clip. So you can see it's got just your standard pocket clip right there, but it's also reversed, so you can actually slide this onto the brim of a hat. I can show this to you a little bit easier there. So it's got this clip that faces the other direction, so you could slide this on the brim of the cap and use it as sort of a, a makeshift headlamp. So that's the uh, Streamlight Micro Stream. Uh, what else do I carry? I usually carry around a right in the rain notebook just to write down any kind of notes, you know, grocery list, whatever. And along with that is a right in the rain pen. Just great things to keep on you. They um, find myself jotting notes down and stuff like that in it all the time. Phone numbers, whatever. And honestly, I mean, I can write something in this with the pen faster than I could type up a quick note or something on my phone. I just fat finger stuff all the time on those keyboards. Next up, and this is just this is a recent purchase for me, and I've only been carrying this here for a, just a short while. Um, and usually I carry like tactical folders, but this is the Swiss Army uh, camper model. And I just, I like the versatility of having some of the extra tools, the uh, screwdrivers, uh, the saw, bottle opener, um, and it's, it's, it's been performing pretty well for me. I'm actually quite happy with 
with um, the tools it have on it and the the usefulness of the tools. And yeah, you got your toothpick and your tweezers, all the normal stuff you get on a Swiss Army knife. Corkscrew for all the wine drinkers out there, which I've used on a bottle of wine, and uh, it worked perfectly. So, the Swiss Army Camper. And as of right now, it's kind of replaced my assisted opening tactical style folders. Um, and I also carry, not always, usually not like around the house, but uh, a lot of the times I carry a neck knife. This is the CRKT Fultz Minimalist. This is the little kind of the, the mini Bowie knife style. I think you can get these in a Tonto also. And maybe a sheep's foot, I'm not sure. And just standard neck knife with a breakaway necklace part. But on the back, you can see there's some electrical tape. Actually, that's Gorilla Tape right there. That's just a small ferro rod um, for starting a fire if the, the Bic lighter gets wet or something like that. And, you know, Actually, a few of the tools on the, um, including the awl, I think mainly, will strike the ferro rod just fine from the, the Swiss Army knife. So I use that as the striker for that small ferro rod. What else is on me? Oh yeah, one more thing. Let me grab it. All right, there were actually a couple things that I had to get off of me. The next thing is I usually carry water with me, some sort of water bottle, some sort of um, canteen or something like that, and typically it's stainless steel. Uh, this is the Blackthorn USA bottle, but always carry water with me. And like I said, it's usually in stainless steel. Let's put that out of the way. Next thing is a belt. This is a True Spec. Um, this is the Riggers belt. I'm not 100% sure the, the the model of the belt. Uh, I've got a, you know, a couple different colors, black, this is their coyote brown, so there's always that, and you know, I like the strength of it, it's not too stiff, you know, most gun belts are really stiff, this isn't too, too stiff, but it's comfortable for me, and it carries what I, carries well what I hang on it, which, fall, winter time, so I do CCW, and... But I carry outside the waistband. For me, that is just the most comfortable. I have not found an inside the waistband holster that I just feel comfortable with. And I am of the opinion if you're not comfortable wearing your gun, you're not gonna wear it. So, like I said, wintertime, fall time, I typically carry on the outside the waistband a full size MP 40. And it's usually in either a Galco leather holster or sometimes it's in a Blackhawk Serpa holster. But when it gets warmer and I'm not wearing big heavy jackets, I'm just either throwing some sort of um, you know, a light jacket on or an untucked button-down shirt. I go between a Smith & Wesson shield, but lately I've been carrying this. This is a Taurus Poly Protector in 38 Special, and I just carry it in outside the waistband, Kydex holster, uh, five shots of 38 Special plus P. So that's, uh, that's my EDC. Appreciate you guys watching. Please like, share, comment on the video. Subscribe to my channel. It's always appreciated. Get outdoors, enjoy yourself, but remember, be safe out there. Thanks for watching.